The riding of Sudbury sits right in the middle of the Nickel Belt, just north of Highway 69, encompassing a small part of the city of Greater Sudbury. Sudbury has been a liberal riding since 1995, but in the 2011 election, incumbent Rick Bartolucci squeaked past the NDP candidate by only 501 votes. And now, Bartolucci is not running for re-election. In fact, all four parties are fielding new candidates. Andrew Olivier for the Liberals, Paula Peroni for the PCs, Joe Cimino for the NDP, and Casey Lalonde for the Greens. Sudbury was built on mining. In 2006, two of the area's major mining companies were taken over by foreign corporations. Now, according to recent Statistics Canada information, only about 2,700 in the riding are employed in mining. The riding's 2013 unemployment rate was 8.5%, higher than the provincial average. But the city is beginning to establish itself in other industries, such as healthcare, the retail sector, education, and public administration. The riding itself is one of the most heavily populated in Northern Ontario, with a population of just over 90,000. The area is home to very few visible minorities. The average after-tax household income is approximately $60,000. The Liberals have a long history of success in Sudbury, but the lack of an incumbent in this race means the NDP could take the riding for the first time in 19 years. Sudbury will be a riding to watch on June 12th.